Yeah, no, there's definitely some violations, but I, I will say this, like. How is he behind the scenes? He's sweet and kind and like nervous and has like, you know, he's just a sweet young boy. Like, you know, you have to put on a fucking act to make it on the internet. Like it's Especially really, it's hard to like, I don't know. Do you think for your, were you 100% being yourself? When? Just, okay, now you probably are at your grown age. Cause now you've like built the hype. But when you were first starting YouTube, you have to be more animated no, yeah, and be more no, crazy. No. Yeah, and I have to be more sexual and more like urban and hood. So, you know, you you just have to put on the show. I think I think this show is the most genuine version of me people can find. Cause I'm just sitting here talking. Yeah, for sure. Uh, uh, but no, especially when you're first starting out as yeah, well. You, you want to get waves, their attention. You want to get that shot content out and you become the worst version of yourself shot depending talk. on. Exactly. I didn't have to do shit. I just had to show up and just be a fucking asshole. I'd start dating a, like, I'm just, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm, that was different for me, I guess because I had rocket fuel with you. So it's a little bit different, but most people, when they first come on, they got to do that kind but of- But you're not naturally shit. an asshole. You're no, not an asshole like that. I'm just, you know, right. I was a little bit reckless when I first started, right. you know, and I did shit that I might not do now, which I guess is the case with him. Were you giving him advice on his, uh, his relationship? Yeah, for sure. And he really likes the girl. So it's like, he does. fuck the internet. Fuck what the internet thinks. Like they hate her. They're going to hate any girl who what? does OnlyFans and makes yeah, money. Yeah, kind of like that. Just because I think they think that she's like a- like a leech for and i'm not these aren't my words but that she's a leech for and using him for clout but i don't know like he likes her she seems to like him and like and you i know. told him that he a he asked me on the phone one day he asked me about it and i was like bro like a lot of people are going to try to give you advice like if you you know what i'm saying like here's the thing men women everybody you have to learn through doing for like sure. device advice is never that's why all these like red pill podcasts and shit like that like trying to give people this like this black and white guide on how to live life that's not how life works no literally. you gotta touch the fucking stove that's it bro your mom and dad mommy and daddy can tell you all fucking day yo don't touch the stove don't touch the stove it's gonna do this to your life to your career bro i'm on this couch right now because of the mistakes i made in my life literally. i would be working some fucking nine to five right literally. now somewhere i'm sitting here doing doing dope shit having great conversations making impact because of all the shit that I went through. So when I at, when he asked me about his relationship on this 30 second call I had with him, I said, bro, if it feels right, do it. If you like the chick and your homies are telling you not to do it, blah, 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 she's using you for this and that, unless it's so apparent to everyone, yeah, yeah, yeah. which it, it doesn't seem like it is, yeah. just go through the motions. If exactly. you get your heart broken, then so be it. And you not go, nice. do you ever get your heart broken? Yeah, yeah. I've got my heart broken. You ever get your heart broken? Absolutely. Nobody's going to tell you, like, your homies are never going to be able to talk you out of that shit. That's not, not how hex. love works. You have to go through the motion. That's it.